And then he said, pass the eggnog. <laughs> <laughs> Hello there. Welcome to the Mandatory Christmas Special, where we're going to spread a little holiday cheer and share with you some of the uplifting and inspirational comments we've received from our fans this year. This is Gary. Merry Christmas. This is Paul. Happy Holidays. This is Max. Mazel tov. Let's get to it. This comment's from Boiled Wolves. This is the most awful site in all of AOL's garbage-ridden arsenal. You call this compelling content? It's just nonsense. It's almost bad enough to be written by Rob Fee, but no, it was some other nonsense blogger. This one is from my good friend Dawn. Paul Eulaine is a little snot-nosed kid that was never good looking to start with. The talented artists he has chosen to make a mockery of were beautiful in their day. I can only imagine what he'll look like at Dylan's age. The difference is, Paul Eulaine has no talent. This is from Russ Mann and it was sent to my personal Facebook page. You must be the douchebag that had a poor attempt to badmouth me on your gay little site that you have my car on. Is that how you feel better about yourself, is to talk shit about someone when they're unable to respond back to you? Yes. This comment comes from Stylet Scar for me. Max Miller, you a big jackass, and I hope you never enter the gates of heaven, you asshole. I hope you burn in hell for the rest of your life. How dare you make a mockery of something so special. Your story sucks and you really need to find another profession. Being a comedian should not be one of them, dumbass. This one comes from my biggest fan, Armac. Paul Eulaine, you are a shallow, mean-spirited, useless excuse for a writer. All of these people, even those I don't care for, have contributed far more to society than you would or could in several lifetimes. How do you sleep at night? This is what you wanted to do when you grew up? Are you proud of yourself? You're going to die alone, ugly, and forgotten about. In fact, you're wasting precious air right now. Hear that, Mom? Someone called me a writer. This is from my pal John Law Hastings. I wear jean shorts daily and have a pair of carpenter pants and I'm not a carpenter. Whoever wrote this can unzip the fly on both my shorts and pants and S my D all day long. Judgmental jerk offs. This is from John Wassum. Hey Corey, you sound like someone's Jewish grandma. Did somebody say Jewish? Happy holidays from mandatory.com. You stupid mother coming to our site. Family sucks. 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 Family sucks.